event today. But you know what? That's being a representative. I also want to be your senator. I want to go down and fix the harm that's been done. So that people don't have to, like me, keep our office open seven days a week. So I'm asking you, please come out. We must get out the vote. We must make sure that people have the phone call to let them know the choice. There is someone I do respect as a person, but Congressman Toomey, and your issues, while well, he's not a witch, <laughs> his book is very scary. <laughs> and I would ask him, more than I've asked in any campaign, because this is about us. This really is about us coming together. I would ask you to give that time. I know I'm not a red meat guy. <laughs> I'm a guy that honestly believes that hard work, persistence, honesty, being willing to be held accountable, and just doing the right thing. It's what we all learned in school, <laughs> is what this race is about. I ran against my party's establishment because I think they had it wrong. I honestly believe it isn't about political calculation over principle. I believe that there are always efforts and should be for principle compromise. But principle should always triumph over politics. And I would ask you, after today, would you give us, we Pennsylvanians, your time? Enthusiasm gap, get over it! There isn't any. This is a race. For us, and I would ask you, please, go out there and just let people know the stakes that are there. Do I believe in this? Oh, yeah. Anybody doesn't think Americans aren't great, come aboard, I tell everybody. Both either my campaign or an aircraft carrier. 5,000 youth, average age 19 and a half, they run that city. Right. Do it for them. Let them come home, fighting our wars overseas to a place where they actually want to say, you know, I'm damn proud of what our United States government is doing. Everyone, thanks to help for being here. <laughs> and everyone, please remember, this ain't about Joe Sesta. This race is about those Pennsylvanians that father that had to walk up those stairs over the last year and a half and tell his son, almost as though he's lost his dignity, hey, I'm sorry, I'm laid off. You're not going to go to the college I thought I had promised you to go. You give an American, just like we did in the U.S. Navy, any color, any race, any gender, any gender orientation. You give them a fair opportunity and they will be all they can be. And the result, we the people, America, will be all it can be. Come on out. Join it. Make it happen. You don't vote once for change. You fight for change. Thank you very much.